show us where you got this bone, huh? Hey. Sword, blades, blades. By the time anybody finds them, his bones will be as white as Jess Barham's. <laughs> <laughs> no sign of Boomer. Hang him from the yard arm. Maybe your shipmate's in trouble. You ever think of that, you little crow? I'm a cockatoo. Boomer wouldn't run off like that. Wonder if Flint's got him. Ah, Flint's got Boomer. Moby loves Boomer. That the dog O'Connell will never find the treasure. I feel sorry for him. Yeah, so do I. Just happened to be at the wrong place at the wrong time. Yeah, it's too much at stake to feel sorry. Let's go. <laughs> in circles for an hour. He's helpless without that dog. <laughs> you dang chatterbox. One more filthy word out of your filthy mouth and I'll dang well do you in. Chatter my box, huh? And you'll never find the treasure. Why don't we grab the captain, give a good going over and toss him back on his boat? He won't come back. But the police will, you knucklehead. Blades! Like you keep your eye on the captain. I'll go back and check on the dog. That cursed dog will ruin all my plans yet. Blades! Blades! Look at this. That is one smart dog. Where's the captain? Oh, don't worry about him, Captain Flake. Flint. Flint. He couldn't even find the ocean by himself. Yeah. Let's go. Hmm? There's our shipmate now. <laughs> Thought we lost you, old buddy. Can you take us to the White Rock now? Huh? Honey, honey. rock before. I never thought to scrape off the moss. It's white. It's got an arrow. Pointing west. How far west? Ah! An arrow points three paces west. The opening lies! You remember, Moby! Three paces. One, two, three. There's an opening. But it's all grown over. I can't get in there. Boomer, you do it. Find the treasure. What is it, Boomer? He wants me, you barnacle. Oh, all right.
How you boys doing in there? Shut up, sir. Ah, dick, baby, dick. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, oh, ah. Right there, mates, or I'll put a musket ball in your gizzard. <laughs> Look what the dog drug in. He found the treasure. You keep your greedy eyes off of it. I don't want your treasure, O'Connell. All I want is to be left alone in peace in this island. Left in peace? Who are you? I know you're not a ghost. I'm the great-great-grandson of Jess Barham. And I'm his great-great-uncle. Cousin. Cousin. All Barham descendants came to this island to find the treasure. For years, all it got us was sore feet and broken hearts. But I was different. To me, the island was the treasure, not the gold. But I knew if anybody found the treasure, half the country would be down here looking for more. And now my beautiful island is gone forever. Well... We'll talk later. First, I want to see what's in this old box. <laughs> how many men have died to find that treasure? I don't know how many men died, but I know one old captain that's going to live. Barham, I got my dream right here. And I'm not gonna hurt your dream. I'll tell everybody I found the treasure on an island 10 miles from here. Thank you, Captain. The only thing I ever captained up till six months ago was a New York City hack. <laughs> <laughs> Where would you like to go for dinner tonight, ladies? Wherever you say, Captain. Oh, golly. Good evening, Captain. Oh, welcome aboard, Betty. Uh, what newspaper are you in? I'm not a reporter. In fact, those interviews you gave were really a bad idea. Well, I just wanted people to know about my good fortune. <laughs> then you won't mind sharing your good fortune with one of your relatives. I don't have any relatives. The relative I'm thinking about is Uncle Sam. Uh, <clears throat> oh, you, you mean you, uh, you're... Um... The Bureau of Internal Revenue. <laughs> Joke's on you! I spent all the money. Hardly any left, except his boat, of course. <laughs> well, Captain, you'll just have to sell this boat. We're also called the Bureau of Eternal Revenue. Fools who spend what pirates marry will end up poor and not as airy. Sail five islands from the west. Ah, you'll find the rest. Ah. <laughs> Where'd you learn that one, Moby? Ah, I got a million of them. <laughs> yeah. Well, time to cast off, Boomer. Let's go find Blackbeard's big treasure. Suit yourself, Boomer. You're gonna miss us once we've sailed. We're gonna miss you too. I come.
like magic. Now stay tuned for more exciting adventures with Boomer as the lovable pooch helps a boy in a wheelchair rediscover his love for basketball. Tuesday night after Father Murphy, James Garner stars as Brett Maverick. Sweetwater is under siege and it's up to Maverick to stop the violence. Later on Flamingo Road, Titus is challenged in his bid for re-election. All Tuesday on NBC.